Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. How have you guys been? I hope you've had a lovely day and everything so far. Anyway, guys, welcome back to my channel. How you guys been? Um, so if you haven't done so already, make sure to subscribe down below and turn on post notification bell so you'll be one of the first to know when I upload a video. So today, guys, we're going on a journey. You guys are coming with me to Manchester. We're going to Festival of Praise. So we're going to um, Festival of Praise. Um, so yeah, it's a big Christian um, gospel concert and it's got so many people there. Um, for example, Sinatra is going to be there um tim goffrey is going to be there and everything so many artists and um, gospel artists are going to be there so i'm going to go and you know spend the night with god and everything it starts at six finishes at 12 thereabouts um and everything so i'm going with my mom and there's all the going to be other church members as well going um but the only thing is my myself and my mom are going to be staying the night in Manchester um because one to not drive back at that time and two just to relax and everything but anyway guys come on this journey with me let's go to Manchester okay guys we just literally got to the hotel now I'm repping my church so that's my church guys the new life in christ ministry and i am based at the branch of the lost parish but that's how hot anyway guys like i said we just got to the hotel i am so i've been driving for like a long like literally this week um i've driven long distance for like i went to ellsbury from ellsbury went to london and then from london back to ellsbury from ellsbury back to mansfield A nice little space <laughs> anyways I mean come on she got the bed got the little station there tea and coffee and all that and then obviously you got another mirror ooh, ooh, yeah and then the TV some extra pillows and the view although you can't really see the view because it's late at night gonna have to show you guys the view again tomorrow morning but yeah that's it so now it's just time to literally get ready for this um concert there's like we intended to be here earlier than this but traffic and everything but anyways um it's supposed to start at six it's literally 5 30 now um gonna quickly grab something to eat first and then gonna meet up with like church members and everything um they're supposed to get here around half seven thereabouts so we'll probably just go in late and stuff so hi guys so your girl is ready we're at the arena we're waiting for our other church members and then we're gonna go in mm -hmm. here's my outfit can't really see that well anyway guys but i'll show you maybe when i get back to the hotel or something what i want but anyways we are currently in the train station leading up to the arena <sighs> so yeah let's get some worshiping and praising god Listen, let, let me just say, I'm not sure that you young people at the front are ready because when, okay, maybe three of my nieces are ready.
When Jesus died on the cross, he died so that you can truly be free. When your past is gone, your future's yet to come. Jesus, that substitute, he soaked it up so that you never have to live with the guilt. That you have to say bye to the old life and choose a new life because your past is done and your future's yet to come. I resign myself to say, actually, I'm going to say that to every single person that I come in contact with at every single gig. But there's some people in here and you've walked in here and you've never grabbed the lifeline. You've never heard it said like this. You've never even had it dangling in front of you. Well, right now, that lifeline is dangling right in front of every single one of us right here in this room right now. Our choice tonight not only changes our destiny, not only changes your destiny, it changes the whole generation's destiny because it changed that tipping point when you put Jesus in the driving seat. We see a nation change, but you have to grab the lifeline. So I'm simply going to ask you to do something really, really brave here tonight. If this is your first time and you want to grab the lifeline and put Jesus in the driving seat and say, my past is done, my future is yet to come. Thank you for dying on the cross. Thank you that you rose again and beat death. If you want to say that, I'm going to dare you to do it. And it's brave because it's in front of everybody. so tired <laughs> like literally so tired not really tired but i'm still okay i'm so energized it's probably still going to take me time to go to sleep but hey ho um it's literally i think five two or they're about to one 
Um, yes, yeah, so I just got here. I'm gonna see if we can grab something to eat. Um, so yeah, and just get ready for the night and get ready to sleep. Um, so yeah, um, yeah, I don't think I had the chance to show you guys my outfit, did I? Let me see if I can go to the mirror and find. So guys, this is my outfit. I've got this top from Primark, jeans from H&M, and I have this like gin um, jacket kind of thing. You guys can see that um, from everything five pounds. And as you all know, my coat is from George Asda and this little hair um, band thing that I have. Um, is from Primark as well and obviously my wig and all of that and the beauty is obviously from God himself because God made me beautiful but anyway guys I shall see you tomorrow when I like you know energized and everything but anyways that's the end for today it's been a wonderful day I'm gonna obviously show you guys the clips and everything but anyways your girl is gonna go grab something to eat and go to sleep and I shall see you tomorrow good morning guys on my way to have breakfast and so I'm feeling a little bit tired like can you guys see the bags under my eyes but oh well God is in control. Anyway, guys, yesterday was a beautiful, beautiful time in God's present. Like, wow, FOP, nine years. Like, Brown. next year is going to be 10. I can only imagine what they're going to do next year. So, I can't wait for that. And we guys going to have breakfast and then we're going to head out. So guys, this is the view. Yes. I'm gonna show you guys on the wide lens on my iPhone 11 Pro. Um, so that's it at a wild, wide lens. You can see everything now. And this is it at the normal lens. And then like a extremely, you know. But yeah, that's it at the wide lens. And you guys can see everything, literally everything. But yeah, that's it very beautiful yes hey guys don't mind the mess behind and everything but i just wanted to show you a quick outfit of the day um yeah so the mess is just because obviously we're quickly packing and wanting to check out and everything anyways outfit of the day so jeans from h&m yes and then this top is from primark yes so yeah, the top is from Primark. Um, I think it was on sale for like about three pounds, but bearing in mind, this was like a after summer sale and everything. And I'm also gonna put the coat that I had on, like the jean jacket. Um, I'll also put it on, but yeah. And my shoes, I can't actually, is it from Primark as well? I think my flats are from Primark. I actually can't remember. But yeah, this is my outfit. <laughs> Anyways, my outfit. Yes, yes, yes. Don't I just look beautiful? Like, damn, God made me beautiful. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Anyway guys, I shall see you whenever. So guys, I am officially back home now and that concludes the end of this vlog. Um, so thank you guys so much for tuning in and everything. If you haven't done so already, make sure to subscribe and make sure to like, comment and 
subscribe you got it anyway guys thank you so much for watching this video if you enjoyed the little vlog that i did for you of um festival of praise and if you've never been to festival of praise i am literally telling you right now you need to be there next year because it's gonna be big because it's their 10th year of running festival of praise in manchester so i can only imagine how big it's gonna be literally it gets bigger every year i started attending in 2018 so this is my third year of going and it literally gets bigger every single time so i can only imagine the artists they're gonna have next year like literally what it's gonna be like for 10 years wow god is good and you know may god continue to you know empower everyone involved in festival of praise and everything and may god continue to you know save and bring people and everything so yeah guys anyway guys thank you so much for watching like i've said i should see you in my next video bye